Hey guys, it's your inner chakras. Welcome back to my channel. We are about to dig in. We're gonna see what um the divine masculine is thinking of this divine feminine right now. Like, what is he thinking of you at this time, fems? Let's ground. Angels for the collected of the divine feminines. How's your divine masculine feeling about you at this time? Divine masculines. How are you feeling about these divine feminines, masculines? Do you love these divine feminines? What is your truth, divine masculine? Like, how are you feeling towards these divine feminines right now? Divine masculines. How are you feeling towards these divine feminists right now, masculines? It's almost Thanksgiving. <laughs> what are you thankful for, masculines? Let's find out. What are you thankful for? Holy Spirit, Holy Angels, please give me clarity to deliver these messages for those that need to hear them at this time. All right, masculines, here we go. How are you feeling towards these divine feminines at this time, masculines? How are you feeling towards these divine feminines, masculines? Okay. Now see, this is like that. So I'm just going to keep it. Y'all know how I am. I'm just going to do that. So I'm unsure. So right now... The Divine Masculine sees you as, like, you're, you two aren't working together. Like, you're not on the same page. Like, you're not on the same page. You're not reading the same book. Maybe you are in the same book, different chapters. But coming together, you two are not. Like, you're just not at this time. Um, it looks like... Because this is in reverse. So it's not an abusive relationship. It's not abusive. It's almost like... Hmm. What is this masculine if it's not abusive? But you're not working together. Maybe he can see that, you know, he's leaving an abusive relationship to come and be with you. However... You two aren't working together. Like you're not seeing eye to eye. And you're not seeing eye to eye because of this child here. So there's a child that you may or may not know about, but you think about. There's a child. So that could be a child there. And that's maybe what the masculine was fighting about. And maybe that's what's preventing him from being able to work with you. However, the six of wands. The masculine sees victory and rewards with you. Like... He can find, he believes that there's success with you. He believes, you know, you two can do things together. So that's where he's at. But he's unsure right here because of a child that he probably hasn't told you about. Okay? And that's why he's unsure. He wants to come towards you, but he's like, but I can't go towards her if I'm talking about this kid. You know, he can't just show up and be like, oh, yeah, I got a, I got a baby. <laughs> okay, masculine, what else? Yeah, and he is bored. Wherever he is currently, he's bored without you. He is missing you. He is missing you. He goes, I'm bored. He goes, I'm over this. Whatever he's trying to get to. He goes, I'm over it. Look, yeah, he's tired of fighting. Seven of Swords. He's walking away from betrayal, dishonesty. It's like he's running away from it. He's running away. And back here, he was running away from an abusive relationship, bullies, theft, you know. And he wants to come to you, but he's just unsure because he hasn't told you about this child. Mm -hmm. But he's tired of fighting for this connection. He's tired of fighting for it. He wants it. But the only reason why you're fighting, Mask, is because you haven't spoken the truth. Holy Spirit, Holy Angels, clarify this page of wands here. Okay, we got two cards. 
Page of Wands. I told you. See, they fighting over this baby. He's tired of fighting, though. He said, I'm not going to fight this anymore because it's in reverse. He said, no more challenges, no more obstacles. He, he says, I'm not going to fight over this anymore. He goes, I'm going to He says, I'm gonna go ahead anyway. Eight of Wands. Yep. He reconfirmed the Six of Wands. He goes, no, I'm going anyway. He goes, I'm just going to have to tell her. He goes, I'm just going to have to tell her. Fem, I went and I had another baby. <laughs> and you know what the fem's going to say if this is a true divine feminine connection? She's going to say, boy, is that what you... Is that why you've been so distant for so long? Are you kidding me? Really? That's what they're going to say. Holy Spirit, Holy Angels. Masculus, what's going on? How you feeling about your films? We see you loving them. We see you trying to get to them. You're trying to get to your films, Masculus. Tell us more. How you feeling about your divine feminines? Serve us up something good for Thanksgiving. Ha, <laughs> damn. Ha. <laughs> He wants total love and support with you guys. He wants to bring these families together. He may even bring that kid. Maybe maybe he's a single dad. Maybe maybe that's the biggest thing. Maybe he has custody of the child. Has anyone ever thought of that? Maybe he has custody of the child and he's scared to tell you because if he has custody of the child and he's coming to you, guess what? That's y'all baby. I mean, it's the, the Carmen's baby too, but if he has custody of that baby and he end up with you, you got to help him raise that baby. Period. Amen. I mean, that's what we do. We're a mother to all. Bring me your kids. <laughs> Bring me your kids. <laughs> Bring me all your kids. Because my daughter is full and grown. So bring me your kids. Come on. I like them little. <laughs> as long as they don't have to come out my body and mess my thing up. I ain't trying to get snatched at this age. <laughs> I'm such a mess. Okay, so... There's a magician on his ass, and it, whoever it is, it's somebody from his past that he just doesn't want to go back to. So he's trying to tell you that somebody's been playing games with him, and they've been controlling him and trying to keep him stuck. So somebody's been trying to keep your masculine stuck, and that's whoever he's over here with. See, they, see all these in reverse? See, and this is what he doesn't want. This is what your masculine's trying to get away from, and he's fighting it. He's fighting it. Yeah, he's trying he said they were keeping them stuck. What else, Masculine? What else you want to tell us? I'll deliver your message. What else you want us to say? Yeah, he said he's over it. He's over it. This is Five of Cups. He said he's tired of feeling at. He's tired of feeling abandoned. He's tired of feeling unloved. He's tired of feeling at a loss. He doesn't want that. And he knows that he will not have that with you. He said he's tired of all of that. He goes, I don't want to feel that way anymore. I don't want to feel that way anymore. But what he wants is a new, beginning, a new beginning with you. That's what he wants. He put an end to one world, and he wants a new world. What else, Masculine? Holy Spirit, Holy Angels. What else, Masculine? What else? How are you feeling about these divine feminines? What's going on with you, Masculine? Do tell. Woo! He said he know he broke your heart. He said, with all of this back and forth and this and that and not coming through and not showing up. He said, he knows he broke your heart. He goes, it's been stressful. He said, it's been stressful for him too. What else, my friends? Ah! He said, but baby, I kept one in my pocket. He goes, I got some new ideas. <laughs> he goes, I know we're going to have our issues. He goes, well, whatever. He said, we're going to come together. He said, we're going to fix this. That's what he said. He said, we're going to fix this. He said, we're going to do it together. Holy Spirit, Holy Angels. What else, my friend? What else is going on? Let's see. What else, my friend? He said, hold on, baby. He said, hold on, baby. I'm coming. See, he's not holding back as much anymore. Before, he was in some type of situation where it was greed and uh, some type of long-term security. He's walking away from all of that. He's walking away from that long-term security, whatever he was in. He's tired of dealing with people that's just around him for greed or around him for money or whatever the situation is. It involves money, pentacles, job, work, whatever. He's over it. He's over it. What else, masculines? Okay, it came out that way. Ooh, he wants to offer you this love, though. 
He wants to be supportive, a leader. He wants to be tolerant and offer empathy. He just doesn't know because of the situation here. He's like, how can I give her this when I got that on my back? He wants to give it to you. He's just having a hard, hard, hard time. Masculine. What's keeping you from those pimps? This is a temperance in reverse. He's, he needs to heal from his past relationship. He said that's what's keeping him from you. All right, masculine. How much longer? Yep. He got some things that he needs to drop down. He got some options. That's why he's not coming towards directly. Because he has some things he needs to clean up. What else, masculine? Because I got some things I need to clean up. Woo! No new beginning, spirit said, though. Maybe there's no new beginnings because it's too many options here. He has too many commitments. He probably has too many commitments. It could be family. It could be money. It's a lot of things on here. It doesn't have to necessarily mean a relationship. But he has too many commitments to the point where he has to break your heart because he can't offer you anything. He wants this new beginning with you. He sees the Ten of Cups with you. He wants this love with you. Like... He's tired of fighting all of this stuff. He knows he broke your heart and he's trying to come to you. But every time he tries to come, something keeps pulling him back. Spirit, clarify this food card in reverse. Maybe he's just not coming right now. Yeah, Queen of Pentacles. Or maybe he sees you not giving him a new beginning because of, you know, what's going on. Did you pull away from him, Phil? Maybe you pulled away from him. Yeah, maybe you're not offering him the new beginning. Or maybe that's how he sees it right now. Because you probably got quiet. You're probably withdrawing. You're like, look, I ain't done with this. Yeah. Queen of Pentacles. He sees you as the Empress. Everything. Yep. Maybe you pulled away. What is this, man? That's just too many. That's just too many. Yeah, he sees you pulled away. Maybe he sees you don't want to know again with him. Holy Spirit, holy angels. Yeah, not a cup. See, he wants to offer you. He wants to offer you this love, but it came in sideways. He's going to offer it to you. He just doesn't know if you're going to take it. It's you. It's up to you. You're the queen of pentacles. You're the one with the money. You're the one sitting on the throne. You're the empress. It's like all he can do is offer it to you. And apologize for the shit that he put you through. Yep. He said, were you going to take it? He says, it's up to you. He said, everything is up in the air. He said, it's up to you. He said, it's up to you to choose whatever you're going to do. So he's, he's, he's just like, what do I do now? What do I do? What do I do? What do I do? So he's going to come towards you. He's just dealing with a lot, fighting with a lot. Yeah, I could be dealing with this right now and you're just tired of it. And that's why he doesn't know how to approach you. He doesn't think you're going to accept his apologies or his truth. Yeah. And it sets him back on the three of wands. It's like he just wants teamwork. Maybe he's going to travel towards you. Maybe I just need to have a conversation of some kind. You know? Maybe I just need to have a conversation of some kind. Yep. Ace of wands. There it is. You're going to have a conversation. Maybe you two are going to work together on a project or something. Inspiration. Yeah. I think the struggle is, the struggle is, because if you see this here and this here, it's a lot of fighting here. And that's why he wants this new beginning with you. He wants to offer you these couple loves and everything. But you're unbelieving because there's too many fights going on. There's too many secrets going on. It's too many whatever he's dealing with over there so you're not really trusting it but here he is again it's like i offer you the king of cups now i'm coming in as the knight of cups like he keeps offering you this love but he doesn't know if you're going to take it but he does he wants this new beginning here with you he doesn't know if you're going to take the new beginning with him mm -hmm. all right what else masculines let's do your final wrap yeah he's abandoning a path see he's coming to you He's walking away from that and that. He's coming. He's coming. He doesn't know if you're going to take it. Look, Nine of Swords, I told you. He's coming. He just doesn't know if you're going to take it or not. All right, last card. Yeah, see? 
He says, I'm coming, but I don't know if you're going to take this partnership. This is two of wands in reverse. It's a new partnership. He's coming. It's just after everything that he put you through and all the back and forth, he just doesn't know if you're going to take his offer. Yep. But there it is, guys. He wants the Ten of Cups. He just, he just doesn't know if you're going to take the offer because of all of that. All of that riffraff going on there. You know? Alright, guys. Thanks for watching. Please like, share, and subscribe. Bye.